Hi, everybody. My name is Patricia Malarche. I live in Anglewood, New Jersey, and I've been working in my studio here since the 1960s. My primary medium is fiber, and that includes any material that a needle and thread will go through. I'm very excited that my piece, Old Bones, is in the 2023 membership show. And I'm going to read something that I wrote about the piece. Old Bones is part of an ongoing body of work in which raised patterns are hand-stitched in fabric and dipped in an encaustic medium, which is hot liquid wax. After saturation with the wax, the fabric stiffens and acquires a skin-like translucence. Five of the six segments in my piece were inspired by a group of Ethiopian healing scrolls at the Metropolitan Museum. I was intrigued by the tall, thin strips, not just for their spiritual content and medical purpose, but also for the challenge of designing on a narrow format. I decided to use their proportions in a series of experimental pieces, each with a different geometric design and a vertical repeat. I chose the off-white fabric so the stitching would be the dominant visual feature. The repetition added a meditative aspect to the project. The patterns go from edge to edge of the three inch strips, so the ridges look integrated into the structure of the cloth. Unexpectedly, some of the diagonals altered the flatness of the fabric. Some sections projected outward, while one element insisted on spiraling around like a Baroque column. The sixth element, a shorter brownish piece is the odd one. This was part of another experimental series for which I took vertical, horizontal, and diagonal units from a simple linear alphabet to create an illusion of text. This provides an outside voice, a needed accent to unify the rest of the lineup. After completing a number of three inch strips, I decided that scrolls should be a bit wider and put my first experiments aside, but they kept calling me back. Finally, their brittle fragility reminded me not of Ethiopian scrolls, but of enigmatic relics found in an excavated tomb, maybe old bones. Thank you for your attention.